A man said it's funny because you even hold on. It's funny because you even though <laughs> right. A man said it's funny though. Uh, Manchester is popping. You can still get a flat outside the city centre for between 150 to 180 k. Locals just don't see the potential. Blood. This is like Hackney all over. Yeah. Obviously, Hackney was Hackney in East London. That was a no go zone back in the day. But some of the locals and that, a lot of them, they didn't see the potential in Hackney. But they should have. Because, let's just explain something, yeah, about Hackney and Islington, yeah? So in Hackney, so, so you've got Hackney and Islington. They're right next to each other, yeah? They touch borders. Hackney is more on the east side. But obviously, you've got North London parts of Hackney, which is Stone Newton and Stamford Hill, a little bit of Manor House and that. Um... And obviously, isn't as next door. Me growing up as a youth man in the early 2000s, obviously, 90s, and that, I've always known Islington. So that's around Highbury, Angel, Caledonian Road, Holloway, Archway, Upper Holloway, them sort of size there, Tufnell Park, them sort of size there. I've always known Islington, um, Hornsey Rise as well. I've always known Islington as a rich man's area, but did you know Islington was the ghetto back in the eighties and that? Yeah. Now you see Hackney now. Yeah. So when I was growing up, Hackney was the no goals on was the ghetto back in the days, as opposed to Islington was like a rich man's. Area. Obviously, I had the cool hood spots and that in it, like you know I'm saying Highbury and that in it, but. I've always known Islington to be a ghetto, um, a, a, a rich man place, isn't it? As opposed to when I was growing up, Hackney was always a ghetto place. You see my little sister, yeah, she's 12 years old, yeah? My little sister, my little cousins are all the same age. When they grow up and they understand economics and property and that, they're going to think that Hackney is a rich man's area because of the generation and the era that they grew up in. Because my sister's so young, in six, ten years' time, when she's 18 you know, when she's 22, She's going to look at Hackney like, yeah, man, that's a rich man's area. I'm going to say to her, yo, you know, Hackney was mad back in the day. Like, man, are pulling up to um, chicken and chip shops and shooting people up. Yeah. You heard about that girl that died years ago. I'm talking about like 09, 010. There were some London fuels use. They pulled up on motorbikes and sprayed up the shop and killed the girl. I can't remember what the girl's name is. If you don't know the girl, that means you lot is old school. What is the girl's name? There was a girl that got shot in the chicken and chip shop. Can't remember the girl's name. It's on the tip of my tongue. It's a young girl. Like when I was like 15, she was the same age as me or something. Isn't it? But yeah, some fuels used pulled up to the shop on their motorbike, sprayed up the shop. Nobody died apart from the girl. What's that girl's name? I can't remember her name, man. 